I think I got a call from from you know the producers of the film and director, and it was it was a really cool thing to do because I feel like they really uh, called me because they wanted that kind of raw, you know, maybe Al Lomax of the future, and Al Lomax is one of my heroes, so I was really excited to talk to him about that kind of music because I've always been such a fan of of that rural South, but this is in the future and dystopian at the same time, so it's going to be fun to kind of mash it all up, you know. And Suzanne Collins, the the writer, has been probably the most brilliant person I've ever talked to in my life. Just an absolute uh, hero. When I talk to her, she puts me in this world. She tells me, you know, kind of every single detail and the feel and the sound, and the inspiration for the song. So it's going to be fun to take all this history of of you know maybe British Isles music and Southern music and 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 mash it all together in this dystopian way in this future and kind of keep it raw and rugged and and it just sounds like a fun thing to do to kind of find a sound that isn't a sound that's been had before, you know? And really find Lucy Gray's voice as well, you know? A music producer is is it's it's different all the time and in, in this case it's kind of find, finding the sound of Lucy Gray in the in the Covey. It's finding their sound. And so it's casting the right players. Uh, I'm having this incredible group of people come down and play on it. Uh, there's a girl Molly Tuttle who I'm a big fan of. And uh, she's one of the best guitar players in the world. So she's coming down, and she's going to be the the sound of Lucy Gray's instrument. Uh, this other girl, uh, Carmela Ramsey, who's amazing, she's coming in. She's playing fiddle, and she plays with Reba McIntyre, and played on tons of incredible country records. Um, but it's kind of casting the sound of these people, and I'm just using my 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 imagination of people I think are great, kind of come in there and you know, put it all in one pot and stir it, and see what we come out on the other end with, you know. Francis loves music, you know, as a matter of fact, every time I've talked to him, you know, uh, you know, online or something like that, you see his guitars in the background, he's really passionate about music, he's passionate about instruments, and so I think he has a, he could probably do all the music himself, you know, he has such a good grasp on what he's looking for as well, so it's been a really great interaction, I think, you know, as we're doing this music, we're going to be all completely interactive, it's going to be Suzanne and Francis and I, uh, going back and forth and really discovering the sound together. So they're going to play a huge vital part in every piece of the puzzle with, with connecting Lucy Gray to film.